<laughs> oh my gosh, guys. Kay tagal ko kong hinintay ako mabigyan ng pagkakataong ma-interview siya. God knows how how many times I've chased this girl. <laughs> For, Finally! <laughs> to be so able to interview too. her one-on-one -on, -one on this kind of setup. Oh. Diba? But ngayon, buti na lang nanalo ka. Oh, because... <laughs> Thank you, Sarah. Natupad na rin pangarap Aww, ko. That, oh, this is my dream too. Wow. Yeah. Kasi, guys, ever since naging aplikante siya for Binibini Pilipinas, I wasn't, I couldn't already take my eyes off her. Oh, mm. no! Grabe, sir. Mm. I'm, I'm Ikaw ba nung application form submission pa lang? Nung kinukunang ka na namin, nagsasubmit pa lang, naramdaman mo na ba yung hype or yung parang buzz around your candidacy? Not really po. Kasi I came from a province, di ba po? So, I don't really know what to expect, what the people think about me. But now, I, I really feel the love mm -hmm. and the support that they gave me. As what your drum beaters have been saying all along, the brightest star in the universe <laughs> because of your name, yes. Tala. Yes, of course. Tala from the 2004 movie of Judy Ag. Judy Ag. Chris Tala. Doon ka pinangalan? Yes. Ooh. From Chris Tala po. Ngayon ko lang, uy, thank you for sharing that. <laughs> yes. Ah. Since hindi ka namin ma-access noon, thank you for revealing that. Tala. Oh, oh, from Chris Tala. Chris Tal Tala. Pinaglihan ng mom mo si Judy Ann oh, habang kinoconceive ka. Super fan siya ni Judy oh, oh, oh. Ann. So, and it was 2004, the, the um, year that I was born. Mm -hmm. <laughs> so, all your life, you're based there in Zambales? Yes, po. Oh, oh. Yes, born and raised in Zambales. So, you're Filipina-American. My dad is Australian po. Oh, Australian. Yes, mm -hmm. and my, dad, my mom is Filipina. Were they able to watch your show last yes, weekend? Yes, my mom is there, but my dad, um, he wasn't there because he already has dementia. So oh. yeah, it's really hard for him too. But I went to Australia like two months ago for uh. me to visit him. Mm. <laughs> Hi, Dad. <laughs> yeah. For sure, he's very proud of you. Yeah. He called me. Alam mo guys, alam ko na talagang, hindi ko alam na sasali siya, pero na-meet ko na siya earlier this year sa sashing ceremony ni Anita. Ah! Pero wala siyang kabinibigay yeah. na hint na sasali siya. Wala po. Wala. Parang akala ko lang guest of honor lang siya yes. doon. Yes. Diba? To support Ate oh, oh. Anita. Kasi oh, oh. po, we were batchmate during Binibining sa Bales. Oo. Oh, oh. so, Tapos tinanong ko pa siya, no, nilang taong ka na? 18? Yeah, parang gano'n. So sabi 18. ko, nako, binibining reserva. <laughs> binibining reserva natin to. Yes. So, nung binibining application, nagulat na lang ako, nag-submit, nag-apply siya. Sabi oh, ko, po. hi! Masali ka pala! Nag nagulat po ang ano. Kasi it was the last day of submission. Yes. So, pa paano mo, paano mo, na paano mo na-arrive yung decision na despite only being 18 years old, hmm. gusto mo na sumabak agad? in a national pageant like Binibining Pilipinas? Kasi po, honestly, Binibining Pilipinas is a lifelong dream. Talaga, yun po talaga yun. Because my grandma, before, she would often include me in Santa Cruzan. Mm. Sabi niya, one day you're gonna be a Binibini kasi she's a super fan of Binibini. And then, suddenly, the urge is there, yung heart mo, mm. parang, the, it's the 60th year, and I feel like joining, I feel like this is my time. Some people may say na, oh, you're too young, you should explore more pageants, yung mga oh. hindi pa talaga national, para to gain more experience. Yes. But I already did four pageants in in Sambales po, and I'm happy about it, and I think I'm ready now for the national stage, and yes, I did do it, I'm here now. <laughs> so, fast forward, to Sunday's coronation night. Mm. What were you feeling when they were about to announce the list of winners? I was so calm that night. Mm -mm. And I was just really praying to God na whatever it is, I'm gonna be grateful. So, yun lang po talaga yung pumapasok sa isip ko. Kung tawagan, kung hindi tawagan, it's gonna be okay for me. Because being a Binibini itself, I know that I already embarked myself into the legacy that the Binibini Pilipinas hold. So, yun po. <laughs> oh, nakakaramdaman namin yung glow mo. Nung ano pa lang ha, nung umpisa pa lang, nung after, nung humahakot ka oh, ng sponsor awards. Ilang, ilang, ilang awards na napalunan mm. mo. Cream Four silk. po. Cream silk, Beauty Derm, Everbelena, 
pizza at banahok. Pizza hut. Oh. Thank gosh. You know what? You're supply ka ng pizza. Yes po. I'm so happy. Oh. I love pizza hut. So tumatak ka. Oh. Love ka ng sponsors. Yeah. I'm so grateful po talaga. Oh. So nung, nung tinawag ka nun na, ayan, sunod-sunod, di mo na alam, Anong kutob mo sa sarili nun? Kaka-perf- kakatapos mo lang mag-perform nun nung evening gown tsaka swim. So, at that time, anong iniisip mo nun? Sabi ko, may, may chance ako, may ganun ko, ganun ka bang oh, iniisip? Actually po, I want to share a little story about it. Nung nasa backstage, medyo stressful po talaga. Kasi may gown po, it's a corset. Oh. So, it's so hard to put on. And we only have like five, six minutes for us to change. So, if you see my performance, I don't have earrings. Oh, I didn't notice that. <laughs> yeah, I, I don't. Nakalimutan mo. No, we were looking for it and then and then nadapa pa po ako. But then before I went out to stage, I told myself, I prayed first na, God, I know na the show is still on and I hope you still give me the grace and the poise for me to continue. And he did. He really mm. did. Answered prayers talaga po. And so when they announced you as part of the top 15, And got to answer your Q and A after. What were you feeling then? I was just so happy about it. I was waiting. I went back to our waiting room with my other sister. I gave them a hug, and I actually like crying because I mm. saw my bini bini sister, and I was just thinking that tomorrow I won't see them. But I know that our friendship will forever be intact. So mm. kahit tapos na bini bini, we will still get to bond with each other. But yeah, that's what I did. Ako naman. Nung sinagot mo yung Q&A mo pagkatapos, parang kinabahan ako sa'yo ng slide. Kasi parang naputol ba yung sagot mo? O parang nag explain ka ng, sa gitna? Tapos biglang, parang you were, start, you were just starting to warm up. Tapos, and you were already explaining it until you got cut. So parang, kind, you ended it with kindness, right? Oh, parang I some ended sort it with, of that um, like, uh, to have a heart Uh-oh. for everyone. And I'm really satisfied with my answer naman po. Um, that part, I mm-hmm. think, I was so really calm that answering that Q&A po. I'm really mm-hmm. calm. So I said to myself that whatever comes top on my mind, kung ano man yung lumabas sa mind ko, that's how I'm gonna answer because that's authentic. <laughs> ilang, ilang, curious ako, pa nagtitrain kayo ng, you're under Sir Roger, right? Yes, pa. Oo, he's very proud of you. Thank nabasa you, ko yung, thank you. Thank parang you may nabasa akong caption or post niya o ano, he's proud of yeah. your performance. Ilang, ilang, paano ka nagtitrain? Curious na ako, sa mga girls na katulad niyo, paano kayo nagtitrain ng Q&A? Kung araw-araw may activities kayo sa Binibini, so I assume, kung magtitrain ka sa gabi pa. Opo, so what I did po is, I have a Q&A in my province. And I told him na, can you stay with me for like two months? Mm-hmm. So we Sa can Manila. do, yes, we can do Q&A every day. Uh-oh. My room looks like a board exam. <laughs> so all the national issues that is happening, we always put another one every day. Okay, this is what happened today. You have to know about it. You, uh-huh. get, you have to be informed. So that's what I did. So I'm gr- so grateful that my Q&A, who is an educator, Um, give time for me to really practice my Q&A. I really want to excel in that segment. So, pa na-talk ka pala sa'yo yung West Philippine question, nasasagot mo rin pala yun. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, I'm really focused on the issues. Uh-huh. Pero at least sa'yo, na, na itawid mo, hmm. di ba? So, nung tinawag kang first runner-up finally, yeah. ano, parang, ano yung pakiramdam mo nun? Happy po ako. Oh. Ha- grateful ako sa nakuha kong... Um, award, mm-hmm. first runner-up, because it's a big thing, po. There was 39 beautiful, empowered girls mm-hmm. there who's competing with me, but I get to be in the first place. Mm-hmm. And I'm so happy, po, with what I got. But, of course, there's still a bit of a first runner-up, because, of course, you're almost there. Yes, yes. But I'm so grateful. Grateful lang po. Yun po. Super grounded ko with what I get. So, How does an 18-year-old like you treat this whole huge responsibility? Because let's face it, your platform is not just all about the glitz and glam. It's yes. all about fulfilling your reign, your duties as well. So from a from a perspective of an 18-year-old, are you done with high school or? I'm in college, Bob. Uh, taking up. 
Uh, Bachelor of Arts in Communications. Ayan. So, <laughs> pwede ka na pala. Oh, pwede mong gawin ito. OJT. Yes. <laughs> so, from, 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 that, from, from your lens, how do you see this whole thing uh, now that you are a first runner-up. So I took it really seriously po. Kasi pageantry, it's not just about the glitz and glam, just like what you said. It's also about making impact to other people's lives and also sharing your purpose. Mm. Kaya po, I know that if I become a beauty queen, I will serve as the voice of the people. My mm-hmm. purpose, which is for persons with disabilities, I really want to make a step into making our world more inclusive. Kaya po, yung pageant for me, it's not just... You're young, you can still explore a, a lot of things. For me, I really take it seriously because it's from the heart. Yeah. Alam mo, even if you're only 18 years <laughs> old, you, see, you seem to have a good head over your shoulders. Oh, thank you, Promise. Po, like, <laughs> I don't know if it's a put on or talagang magaling, magaling ka lang magdala, pero you're very natural. Thank you, po. Thank yeah. you Sir Aldo. Uh, whoever is training you, uh, good anwa. Kudos. Yeah, Kudos I'm so him. grateful for that. Yeah. So, can you give a message to all your supporters and followers? Especially to everyone in Sambales who can't wait for your return. For sure, may hinahanda na silang parada as early as now for you when you return yes, home. Po. Hello everyone, especially to the people of Sambales. We did it! We clinched the first runner up. I hope you're proud of me and I'm so, so grateful for your support and your love for this journey of mine. I hope you continue to support me if I embark into a new journey. Thank you so much. I love you guys so much. Everyone who supported me. I enjoy mo yung rain mo. Yes. Bata ka pa. Definitely. The world is your oyster. <laughs> I enjoy mo lang to. Sumunod ka lang sa kanila. Nako, nakikita ko talaga malaki Aww, ang future you, mo sa pageantry. Thank you, Sir Adam. Thank you po. Basta huwag ka lang magbabago. Yes po, of course. That's what I instilled in me. Whatever happens, I always have to stay grounded. <laughs> Thank you, po. So, congratulations once again. Thank you, po. Thank you. And I hope you have an amazing year-long reign ahead Thank of you. you. God bless you, Thank Tala. You, and congratulations once again. Dear, I happy Thank, <laughs> Thank you, guys. <laughs> Thank you, Sir Adam. Yeah. Salamat <laughs> po.